How can I explain? At first we thought it was a game. That we knew what they were all about. After traveling God knows how long by train, plane, bus, car, boat, we... We lost all sense of time. And we were told nothing. Absolutely nothing. So how could I explain it to you? Like in a trance, without a word. The procession begins towards the ceremonial grounds. Our isolation from the world we left behind is complete. And my mind empties of clutter. And for the first time, I am filled with clarity. The suffering of strangers, the agony of friends. There is a secret song at the center of the world, and its sound is like razors through flesh. Oh, come. Oh, you can hear its faint echo right now. I'm here to turn up the volume, to press the stinking face of humanity into the dark blood of its own secret heart. Welcome, welcome. Um, so we finally got everything switched over last night to uh, Streamlabs after the huge snafu that occurred live last night on the... Uh, I hate cables mixed up. After the huge snafu last night with OBS... Uh, just decided to actually crash at the beginning of a stream. Uh, I was just, like, I was incensed about it because it just, that it just killed everything going on. Uh, it was just amazing, you know. Typical of of stuff happening in the midst of all that, you know. So, uh, and I think I worked on it about a couple of hours, getting things transferred over. So it imported it imported most things over into. Uh, Streamlabs. It's it wasn't it wasn't fun to say the least. I am getting hot. a lot of noise today on this. I can there is literally nothing playing. Very odd. Uh, very, very odd. So, just gonna do uh, a small, and I think this is probably gonna be basically like a drone show. Um, I do not know. Ah! Okay, I do know. It's the Super VHS plugin I've got going. That was absolutely atrocious on sound. So, I think probably what we'll do here, guys, is...
Uh, we'll put another instrument in. Maybe a track. And yeah. external instrument. Pro VS Mini. One. So we'll set that, then we will put some um, So that, and then let's put ourselves what? This has got ridiculous on these commercials for. None of those. We got this. So cool. Uh, drone show. There we go. There we go, folks. Hold on. And there we go. All right. So I think we'll start get things linked in. So we'll be using uh, Serum on a pad called PD New Drone Brackets GS. And I think I'll just go ahead and start. Oh, real.
So. Not necessarily. So, okay. I don't know how to make this larger. All. Okay. No, I guess it wasn't what I needed to do. That's weird. Okay.
Figured this out the other day. Not going. Well, there's always a manual reset. Sometimes these things forget. Or Ableton forgets one of the two. I don't know which one is typically here. And And there we were. I'll say this. Software's interesting, but it just doesn't give that that maybe I just don't have it tuned right on uh serum, but the virus gives such a growl on some of that low end. So the, the sustain is not catching.
That's all supposed to be sustained. And nothing is sustained. So that's kind of uh, strange. Yeah, okay. I think it's forgotten itself too. Which is quite odd. I guess everything's forgotten itself. Yeah. It didn't like that. Well, what do you know? So this is what I can do. We'll just restart. Covering the world. Radio Freedom. Remorse for what? You people have done everything in the world to me. Doesn't that give me equal right? I can do anything I want to you people at any time I want to, because that's what you've done to me. If you spit in my face and smack me in the mouth and throw me in solitary confinement for nothing, what do you think's gonna happen when I get out of here? Uh, guilty. Hmm. 
I wouldn't do anything that I felt guilty about. You don't feel guilty at all? There's no need to feel guilty. I haven't done anything I'm ashamed of. Well, there you go. The thing is weird in the fact that it sees the mic. Yet, yet it doesn't, oh, it's kind of weird. Well, what in God's name goes on? Boy. Now that I don't why the microphone doesn't use so no. that's crazy and the mic's coming through fine I'm checking myself here I don't think it thinks it's a mic, but it's not a mic. It's wow. Processor is just peaking. Ableton wants to re-index everything all the time. And nothing at all to remember what's done and what's not done. Cancel. We got an 843 gig processor, 64 gigs of RAM. Jesus. This goofy thing. Uh, so I don't really know what.
why it thinks it's a mic. It is a mic, but why it doesn't. And I turned off the mini cam, but as far as the volume on them, there's no reason for them. Hey there, Anton. What's up, brother? Speaker phone. I hear ya, sir. So that... How's that sound? Is the audio sound okay for me speaking? How's the screen look? I've got everything up. Does it sound okay? Cool. All right, good deal. Yeah, that's after I had the uh, shitstorm last night and lost my stream. Uh, this is a different program than what I was using last night. So this is a bit more stable. Uh, a lot more stable than what OBS was. This just doesn't have, I can't put like the audio spectrum on it and all that junk. But uh, maybe OBS will come out with a new version. And I can swap back on there. I uh, hope everything's going well over on your in your side of the world. losing so I right, I'll tell you what I'll do I'm gonna let you hear the intro to the stream. Uh, I think it's probably the best piece of cinematic that I've ever done. So just hold on real quick and let me let me get to it, okay? I want you to check this out. How can I explain? At first we thought it was a game that we knew what they were all about. After traveling God knows how long by train, plane, bus, car, boat, we we lost all sense of time when we were told Nothing. Absolutely nothing. So how could I explain it to you? Like in a trance, without a word. The procession begins towards the ceremonial grounds. Our isolation from the world we left behind is complete, and my mind empties of clutter. And for the first time, I am filled with clarity. Recovery. You people have done it. Radio Freedom. So what do you think of that intro, dude? Like, that is just... That's uh, Martin Sheen 
but uh, it's off of a KLF song called The Right to Move. They got him to do that like in 1992. And so I ripped that audio off uh, using stems. And that's the intro with the, the film roll and all that stuff. I'm actually uh, just kind of piddling around right now. And time, uh, I'm trying to wind myself down considering I got to be at work at seven in the morning. Uh, and I was like, uh, my significant other, Tammy, was like, you need to go do something because your energy is absolute out of this world. Okay. Uh, I will. And so that's what I did. <laughs> I, uh, Let me think. I don't even know that I have anything that you haven't heard. Uh, I just really haven't put out anything at all. Uh, you haven't heard crashing issues was a uh, was a. Um, an ambient piece I did. It was a one-shot take a while, uh, a couple nights ago. I think I uploaded it. But let me see if I can find it. It's called Crashing Issues. It was a uh, ambient massive piece. Just bear with me. This was a uh, one-shot wave that I one-shot song I did the other night. Here you go. Sunday night. This is live. The only live set I've done tonight. What uh, what you're listening to? This was just a, uh, a literally a one shot. DJ Renegade in the mix. A one shot take. I've uploaded a bunch of stuff to YouTube to play out this week, but because I, I probably won't be able to do, but maybe one one stream uh, this week other than tonight, maybe two, but I don't know. Depends on how tired I am. I haven't worked in two and a half months, and I've been in boxers literally the whole time, so I've got to actually put on shoes and like real clothes. It's going to be weird. It's going to be actually really weird.
Cool, you can hear that glide on that synthesizer. You see that on the waveforms. That's really freaking cool. Oh, pitch shift. So there it is again, and it's just like a put it on a, a sawtooth for that. So it's kind of cool how that ramps up and plateaus off. It's definitely not a sine wave. Kind of a different look, you know, get to see the music. Since I can't put it down. I could. It goes up again. That is so cool. I put a really high glide on that. You know, a mono synth or polyphonic aftertouch. It'd be nice if it was stereo, but I put a delay and a reverb on it. It's great. That is so cool. I don't think I've ever watched this like this. Wow, there's those sweeps up top. Oh, and that's the uh, drone box doing that. That's way high up in the spectrum. <laughs> that there's a the cutoff. Wow, the, the decay on that, that was from the uh, Behringer uh, Model D. That is so cool. There it is again, another one. Boy, all the red is getting burned out of my eyes.
Oh, that is so wicked. It's a wondrous thing to get to do this. Yeah, it's, uh... Look at that, Anton, how that, that bass ramps up. That's so freaking cool. The spectrograph. Then here it drop off. There it is to a low C. That is so freaking wicked. I'm going to have to find that base again. That high pitched noise you're seeing up there, that's the, uh, that's the wave state. Oh, wicked. Look at that. Anton, check that out. Rock.
That is so badass. I wish you could see this on these 32 inch monitors, man. It is just freaking overwhelming. And there we go. I did that on the fly. Oh God, my eyes are jacked up. Crazy. Having trouble seeing. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna get off of that. That's just covering the world. Radio freedom. Good boy. All right. Uh And not much longer for here tonight. There is that base. Ba 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 base. Now let's put a hell of a slide on it. That's a hell of a bass drop. So I'm going to actually have to record that. Because that is so freaking awesome. Put a longer glide on it. And that'll be... So those I love bass drops like this and two octaves. It's actually an octave, but I'm an octave low. There's another program that'll do this, but it, it generates tones. Uh, it is called, it's an old program too. 
is still in production. Uh, Audacity, I don't know if you've heard of that. You probably have, that's an old school. And it'll actually do bass drops, but they don't sound like there's the characteristics don't sound like this. With resonance and that's just changing the glide on that, actually making. Put it on a, just a straight up sine wave. We can put some more glide on that. Yeah, that's that's some count right there. That's a second, 1.46 second uh, glide. Two thirty. All right, well, guys, sorry, it wasn't just a, uh, a whiz-bang of a show tonight, but I am pretty tired, and I need to wrap this up. I need to get, well, finish winding down for uh, my, try to get some sleep tonight and rest I know it's going to be difficult I don't sleep well but uh, Adi, that makes sense um so Without further ado, I appreciate you joining in, and yeah, I'm sure it can. Audacity does it too. This is just the uh, Archura Micro Freak can do it as well. So. That's pretty fun, too. I can show you this. Hold on. In deep space. Big Jane Renegade in the mix. And we can watch the rise and fall easily here. It goes up. C3. It's pretty dead on C3. To C1. That's pretty cool. And it reads the damn notes. It's F3.
Anyway, that's pretty cool. Good little program. Uh, it's a freeware program, actually. Exit. Covering the world. Radio Freedom. All right, Anton, I will catch you in a day or so. Uh, gave you the scoop on the new job uh, and get back to some kind of normalcy and we'll start doing some music again. Uh, I look forward to it. Thank you, everybody. I do have a show planned for Sunday night. Barring I'm not working uh, with the Golden Shrimp Guild. So I will uh, be checking that out as well. And you guys have a blessed night. This is... DJ Rudicate, and I am...